Duke is the hero of all the engines. This is a story about him. It happened. your boat to the mainland and that would never do. One day, Duke didn't feel well. He was short of steam and needed to rest. His driver and fireman had just finished clearing his tubes when Stuart bustled in. Hello, Grand Puff, he teased. Are you short of Puff? Nothing of the sort. This is routine maintenance. Tell you what, went on Stuart, you're getting old. We must take care of you in case you break down. <laughs> Hoosh, Duke, that'll be the day. Duke couldn't stay cross for long. It was a lovely evening. Couldn't be better, couldn't be better, he chuntered happily. They began to climb. But Duke didn't mind. Had plenty of steam, he puffed. We'll be up in a couple of puffs. But soon, Duke's puffs changed to wheezy. His valves were leaking steam. It's not so easy. It's not so easy, he croaked. But I'll manage. At last, they reached the station. Duke's driver examined him carefully. Anxious passengers waited for news. Duke is going to take him to the harbor, but he might be late, said the conductor. So two engines are coming to help. You'll still catch your boat. Falcon buffered up in front. Poor old Grandpa. What a shame he's broken down. <laughs> Tease, Stuart. This is the day. He was coupled on behind. Are you ready? Whistled Falcon. Yes, I am, replied Stuart. station the cavalcade split up falcon took duke's passengers to the boat stewart headed falcon's train with duke coupled behind fancy me rescuing grandpa this is the day this is the day he boasted poor old engine poor old engine but duke still had plenty of steam left in him his valves sounded worse than they were he and his driver had their own little joke ready they waited until they reached the hill. Now, said his driver, Duke puffed 